I'm coming back to debunk. There she is. The entrance to the basement. Hey everybody, it's the shake coming back at you. It's hopefully another good video. This is the parking lot. All right. Take you a good gander, peeps. All right, let's go. This is the entrance to the basement that I'm coming back to debunk. Um, there's the basement door right down there. Get a good look at it. Now, the reason I bring that up is because it's below the parking lot. So, you can't say a reflection through a window is what caused that shape, that's for sure. Let's go! Do do do! Do do do! <laughs> Last time I was here, it was a bit floated. Ooh, a bee. Okay. Mm hmm. <laughs> Now, there's your window, which uh, is very high up above my eye level, to be completely honest. Woo! Watch the water. Gotta walk across the blocks, boys. This is the entrance to the basement. It's the only way in and the only way out. I was over there. And I'm going to go set it up. I'll take you around the basement too. Uh, I'm going to, that way I can show you there's no other entrance except this door. All right, let's go. Okay, guys. Right there. On that barrel is where I had the lights laying. They were pointed that direction. So at least we know where the light is. The light was. Okay. It'll take me a second. It won't be the exact same shot because uh, it's impossible. But it'll be... As long as we know where the light's at, that's really the important part. Um... Let me set it up. I got to look at the shot and I'll be right back. Shout out to my boy Polly D for the image in the top left corner. We're worried about distance from the wall. That way it'll tell how big my shadow was. That's more important than anything. Shout out to my good friend Polly D, the Mad Kiwi. Uh, he, he watched this on his big screen TV and I want you guys to look very carefully. After I walk off the camera, look over to the right right there. You can see the beam of the flashlight. He slowed it down. That way you could look at, you can even see color. That is so wicked. All right, guys. The beam was focused directly where I got it at. But I'm going to try a different light because that one's putting off more light. I don't want more light. I want less light. That's less light. What the hell? So the flashlight's going to be the same distance. The only difference is it's a little lower than it was aimed in the other video. But the same distance means the same size shadow. And that's really important. All right. All 
All right, guys, that's as close as I can get it, okay? But that's almost the exact same shot. Now, I'm behind the camera. Let me move in a little closer. That way you can see better. Let me get you all lined up here. This one's a little too bright. Oh my god, hold up. Alright guys. I'm here to debunk it one way or the other. Um, some people said that when I went uh, uh, behind the camera, see there's my shadow. Now, I'm going to show you out here in a minute what's over there, wherever this peaked out. For it, I'm dead. Now, y'all said it was me bending over. I had my blue mask on. Let's go. Now the only way I could have pulled that off was to run all the way around this big unit and come back over there without you guys seeing me. How did I do that? Without you hearing that? I don't know if it's a ghost, I don't know what it is. I just know it wasn't me. Now, let's see. I'm gonna go back behind the camera and bend down for you guys. I'm trying to see how big my shadow is. It's impossible. There's no way. Uh, let me try a different light. Just a second, guys. Okay, you're back. All right. That's a smaller light, duh. I'm gonna bend down in front of it. Oh. You see what I'm saying? It's blurry, but... Okay. But that's what I wanted to show you guys. All right, guys, here we go. Let's have a little spirit box session going. Now, this shadow coming up is actually close in size, but look where I'm at. Was that you I seen the other day? Or not. You can knock, you can get in front of the camera, you can talk into the camera. Are you mad that I'm here? Feel free to come out here and slap me right in the snot box. Let's go. How old are you? That's a bad feeling. Show yourself. Don't be scared, homie. I'm gonna go right back there again. It's a little brighter now, so. But yeah, this is where it was, whatever.
Feel free to do whatever you want. Knock once for yes, twice for no. Was that you I seen the other day? That was one knock. Hmm. Are you able? Do you want me to leave? There's no way I'll come back at night. Now that I can't debunk it? Nope. No thank you. Not for all the golden Texas. Come get me. As you can see, guys, it was whatever it was was right there. Was it a ghost? I'm not going to say it was. You know how I feel about ghosts. I'm just saying this awful lot. There's just, there's no way that was me. It's impossible. Like I said, the only entrance is over here. There's the door. You can come out and say hi. A lot of moisture in there. A nice little dolly. And no, this ain't my basement. This is the basement at the high school, guys. Sorry. Sorry. All the way around here. Now when I get home, I'm going to edit the video and try to recreate that figure that was right there. Right there. Do do do. Mm -hmm. Was it a ghost? I don't know. Maybe not. Could have been just some kind of a, a artifact left over. Although, I wouldn't bet on that. Uh, but I know one thing, guys. It was not me. <clears throat> I do got one question. Come out and punch me right in the snot box. Flip. You got all these ghost hunters on YouTube. How many times have they uploaded with no ghosts in their footage? Never. Zero. Why is that? Because you don't get views. All of them. How come when they catch a ghost on camera? It was right there. But how come when these big YouTubers catch a ghost on camera, they don't act that impressed? I mean, I've done been back here. I'm pumped over what I call. Why do, not, do they not get pumped? I don't get it. They film a video and they never speak about it in the next one. It's like they forgot that a woman in white or a black figure was on their other video. Why is that? Because it's hard to be impressed if it's not real. I mean, I'm not trying to be a butthole. I'm just, I'm just spitting facts, son. Go on that dark part.
Anybody in there? And guys, I'm impressed that you even question footage that I upload because that shows that you guys aren't hypocrites. And that you hold me to a standard just like you hold everybody else. And I appreciate that. All of you. Even the ones that gave me a migraine. You're awesome. Because that needs. We need that. Whoa, watch out, son. Oh my goodness. I just keep getting a bad feeling about that spot over there. And I can't figure out why. Anybody in here? The fact of the fact of the matter is, guys, through this uh, debunking of myself, I've spit out a few facts. I couldn't debunk it. Was it a ghost? I'm not. I'm not going to say it was. Uh, but I just know that I can't personally debunk it. So. But we tried. But I got plenty more content coming. And also, the guy I linked up a, few, a couple of weeks ago, Hood Horror, that does uh, scary narrations, him and his family called The Big C. I'll tell you what the name of it is, they demonetize him. Uh, Hood Horror. I appreciate if you can give, give him some love. And check out Sam, this guy. The youngest shapeshifter, I got his mom's permission to put him in this video. Guys, go subscribe to the shape, okay? He's a great guy, he's really nice, and he's supporting this channel. So, why don't you go give him a visit and be nice to him? He's a nice guy. He debunks ghost videos, which is really cool, to be honest, because a lot of them are fake, and uh, it's good to have someone debunk them so we can see if it's just fake. But, yeah, go support him. He supports me, so, yeah. Uh, that's all I've got to say today, um, and uh, thank you for subscribing. Go show him some love. You can't comment, but you can sub, or he's a kid. YouTube has guidelines against that, and I don't blame him. But go check his channel out. He's a, he's a better actor than most adults. Love you guys.